here's a quick look at my flow through um, wheelie bin. Um, the uh, tray in the bottom quite often gets um, material um, in it, uh, as in self harvesting. Um, we've got quite a distance between the centres uh, at three inch centres on these um, three quarter inch um, plastic conduits. Um, I just leave this tray in the bottom with some dampened newspaper and you end up finding um, a few handfuls of worms in there every week. Um, but the stuff that does self harvest seems to be a little bit moist to start with, but then within a day. It's um, nice and light and crumbly. Um, there's quite a bit of um, a bit of it in there. You probably can't see, but there's quite a bit of it in there, and, and handfuls of um, worms in there. Um, in the top, um, I've got the um, as I posted up. I've got the the cardboard layer um, with the uh, paper pulp underneath. Um, I have been disturbing this while there's not so many on top as what I what I found yesterday. Um, you can see um, see there. There's quite a few worms um, have come to the top into the new um, into the new bedding and food that I've got in there. Um, maybe you'll see um, in there. I don't know what you'll be able to see from the video. But anyway, the worms do seem to love it. They came they came up into it within a couple of days. I just always leave the, the dry cardboard chips on top. Thanks very much.